Welcome to this video on data size, data capacity and data rate. Data size, capacity and rate are all important terms and concepts in digital theory and essential for home and project studio owners to understand. For example, it is often important for us to be able to calculate how much hard disk storage space a project may require when configuring a DAW's sample rate and word length. It may also be important for us to know how we should configure the properties of an MP3 file to meet the data rate requirements of a given distribution platform. Data size is expressed in bytes, kilobytes, megabytes, gigabytes and terabytes and is used to express the size of digital files such as system components, applications and data including digital audio. For example, Average MP3 files have a data size of approximately one megabyte for every stereo minute and an overall average data file size of five megabytes. CD quality audio files have a data size of approximately 10 megabytes per stereo minute or five per mono minute and an overall average data file size of 50 megabytes for a five minute song. The term data capacity is used to express both the capacity of short-term memory modules such as RAM, flash RAM and ROM and the capacity of long-term storage devices such as hard drives and DVD-R disks. For example, average hard disk capacity is measured in terabytes and DVD-R disks can hold approximately 4.3 gigabytes of data. It is important to know that data size and data capacity are almost always expressed by operating systems in terms of 8-bit bytes. So for example, the data size of a file containing 7 16-bit bytes would be expressed as 14 bytes. This ensures we always know absolute size and capacity. The term data rate is used to express three things. One, the average amount of data per second that a digital video or audio media file contains. Two, the maximum speed of a connection technology such as USB, Ethernet or an internet connection and is also known as bandwidth. And three, the speed with which data can be transferred from a storage device to RAM, also referred to as sustained data transfer rate. Note that data rate is usually expressed in bits, thus 256 kbps is the same as 256 kilobits per second, i.e. 8 times slower than kilobytes per second. The script for this tutorial, along with accompanying images, can be found at our website projectstudiohandbook.com. We suggest you subscribe at our YouTube channel and join our mailing list at our website to receive notification of new videos, blog posts and subscriber only extras. Thanks for watching.